So a number of people asked me uh, how it is that we came to conceive of the LA Theology Conference, where it all came from. Um, there's quite a story behind it, in a sense. <laughs> um, maybe you want to say something about that, Fred? Well, I, I had thought of having a regional conference um, oh, way back in maybe 2003 and thought, oh, someone should do this, but I don't really know how to handle the logistics of it and kind of put it out of my mind for a while. And then um, you and I were at a small conference at Point Loma. It was yeah. it was good and well run, and they made it look easy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I think we were just eating lunch in the cafeteria thinking, well, this is no big deal, and it's a great conference. Mm -hmm. We should do something like this. Yeah. I think I what, as a, a newcomer to Southern California, one of the things that immediately struck me was here's a huge city of 10 million people or whatever, and with a number of different theological schools or schools that have got, you know, theology faculty or people who do religious studies uh, in the area. And I was wondering, you know, to what extent there, there was a kind of conversation going on between different institutions or whether there were things like our conference going on in L.A. already that I could plug into. And I thought what was interesting is as we talked about this, it became clear that there didn't seem to be that sort of thing. And we both agreed that, well, it looks like this would be a really good thing for us to do. It would make a potential impact on the region and it'd be a great place to have a conference like that. There's so many resources around um, that it was a kind of natural thing to think about trying to push forward. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so lots of theological life going on uh, in the Western United States, but everyone's kind of in their silos. And so if someone has a good event, uh, they even have trouble publicizing it to other schools, even like-minded schools, never mind, you know, working across a broader spectrum. Yeah, so this building of bridges between institutions as well as finding a kind of common place where we can do theology together, those two things I think are really vital. And um, I think it's a very exciting prospect to have uh, a, a, an annual theological conference in the LA area where we, we all come together and we think really seriously about central doctrinal topics of the Christian faith across sort of denominational boundaries in a sense, but, but seeking to really kind of reason together in a, uh, in a way that brings about some really constructive systematic theology that's fantastic. Yeah, so I'm, I'm a bit of a California booster, so the idea of not having to, you know, cross the Mississippi River to get to the theology is, yeah. is attractive. But also, um, even, even nationally, there's not a similar conference that focuses on Christian systematic theology mm -hmm. um, in that way. There are lots of good conferences, but they all go broader. So right. this, is yeah. a, this is a more narrow focus on classic doctrines. We're doing Christology now, then Trinity, Atonement, pneumatology, nothing surprising. In that sense, nothing creative, just mm -hmm. pretty predictable. These are the key doctrines. Right, but I think you're right that there's a, there seems to me to be a perceived uh, need for, for that kind of voice in, in the American theological scene and to have a place where people can come together and really engage seriously with central Christian doctrines is something which is a very exciting prospect. I must say I'm very excited about seeing what will happen with this project. Mm -hmm.